How's it going, YouTube community? This is a team deathmatch on checkout of the Gears of War 3 beta. I'm gonna quash a very quash. I'm gonna squash a very quick question right about now. No, I do not still have the Gears of War 3 beta. It's the servers aren't even up, so you idiots shouldn't say that. Like, obviously this is gameplay from a while ago. And right here, I'm gonna show you how easy it is to get kills with Retro Lancer. Yep, that's how you fucking kill people. And that's how you properly hump in Gears 3, just in case you guys don't know what it know. And right about now, I'm about to die randomly by a frag grenade. Yeah. I don't even know, I, I didn't even see a frag. Nor did I hear it get thrown. Yeah, that, but that's just my personal opinion of the game. Uh, I'm gonna give you guys some thoughts about my the Gears of War 3 beta. My, my final markup, I guess. Alright, overall, this game is actually pretty fucking good. And here's another quick ass look uh, kill. But overall, the game is good. The hit detection, it's pretty on point overall. I mean, may yeah, maybe you will get cheated out of a few headshots. I mean, it's fucking Gears of War, and they can't make it perfect. But, uh. I would say this Gears of War 3 beta definitely has a replay rate of. I don't know, maybe like 200. Like. 200 times I'm gonna play this game compared to the 100 times I'm gonna play another game or any other game that I have which is Gears 1, Gears 2 and Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 and COD 4 so I'm probably gonna play this game a shit ton more than any other game I own but uh, like I, I, I'll just move on to the next subject weapons um, I think they could do a few adjustments, which they already are doing some. I mean, according to some articles I've read, they've already changed a little bit of the Retro Lancer. They aren't changing the sawed off to everyone's disappointment, and that's a nice shot. But <laughs> uh, the bull talk is overpowered. I that's I kind of agree with that. I think the retro is overpowered, and the sawed off. I'd say. If you have seen Dominated's video, whatever, Doom, the guy who runs Gears of Peter, if you've seen his video about the Sada and the Retro Lancer, then you're going to know what I'm talking about. I think they needed, that's, those are the exact changes I think they should do. And I've been saying ever since probably, I think day two, that's when I started hating the Retro Lancer, uh, that I always thought that they should tone down the Retro Lancer somehow or make it a pickup and that's literally the exact words I said on day two of this beta being out or actually it wasn't it wasn't even technically out yet I illegally got it and gave it to a few people <laughs> but uh like I like the sniper hit detection although I wasn't too good at it at first and this is actually one of my older ones uh, as you can see no scope clearly registered I mean, it was on a bar, but yeah. That's, that, like, never fucking happens in Gears 2. You get a fucking headshot, and you're so fucking happy. And then, of course, montage standards. You, you fucking can't even get... You get an on-screen double, and it's still not even a clip, technically. And I just dome that Marcus again, that poor fucking bar. Well. Uh, Torque Bow? I'd say the Torque Bow is a little weird, uh, but it, it does exactly what anyone would want the Torque Bow to do, so... Um... Shotgun, pretty efficient, works all the time, the Nasher I'm talking about. Uh, Lancer is pretty nice. I think the Hammer Burst needs a little bit more recoil, but that's about it. I think it doesn't have enough recoil to be considered a weapon I would like. Because, like, I mean, if you have a mod, you don't fucking miss a fucking shot because there's zero recoil on that weapon, and it's stupid. I mean, there isn't even that much recoil on a freaking... What if that stupid gun is? Retro. Uh, let's see. Now. That was a nice ass blind fire. <laughs> uh, some things I like about this game. The movement they made. They added omnidirectional evade. I thought that was pretty cool. Because now you can dodge more than just one way. And it gets easier to av avoid shots. So if you want to go ham or turkey as I like to call it and just clutch everybody, you can fucking jump in between them, going sideways and shit, going through loopholes, and then be like, what's up, bitch, I'm gonna jump through you. That was my impression of a black person that's really good at gears. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, like, pretty much, like, 
this I think they did exactly what they wanted to with this game. They made a game that is slightly noob friendly, but can still uh, m match up with uh, pros, I guess you could call other people. <laughs> I mean, obviously veterans of the Gears series know how to play the game, so... And, uh... Idiots, obviously, will never ever learn how to play this fucking game. Because they'll be garbage for the rest of their life. I mean, in Gears 2, they fucking added Title Update 6 that made hard aiming literally insta down. And guess what every retard did? He hard aimed. So you can get somebody who just picked up the game, get a kill on someone who's a complete veteran and has been a veteran. Which I think which is completely stupid, and that's why so many people love Gears 1 way better. I mean, let's be completely realistic. And I said realistic, just so you guys know. Um, if you were a pro at a game and you got shit on by a complete noob who just fucking bought the game, how pissed off would you be? Of course, you're going to switch to Gears 1 where everyone's pretty much equal and you can tell good people from bad people instantly. Because, you know, guy walk around with a fucking Lancer in Gears 1 trying to get close range kills, obviously, compared to the guy with a shotgun who's strafing or wall bouncing, whatever. I mean, overall, they, all the guns and all the changes made to this game pretty much did what they were supposed to do besides the retro and the sawed off which were additions to the game and they were just stupid additions but you know Epic and Cliffy being that faggots you know they always know how to fuck up a game I mean look what they did to Gears 1, Gears 2 